So, you might believe that 110 FOV in Apex is actually the max FOV, but it's not. You know how some abilities like Bloodhound's ult and Octane Stim actually increase the FOV like this? It's go time. If you look at the edge of the screen, you can actually see that the FOV is increasing slightly when the ability is activated. Now there's actually a way to achieve this FOV at all times. You can see, I'm on 110 FOV, I'll, I'll prove it, change, then go back. I'm 110 now. If I press F12, you can see that my FOV increased slightly, did you see that? Now it's permanently like that, without the ability. And the ability doesn't make it go higher. We are now permanently at the max FOV possible in Apex Legends. And I'll show you how to do that right now. now. All you have to do is go into Steam, right click Apex Legends, click Properties, Local Files, Browse, go into the Config folder, the CFG folder, right click in an empty space, click New, Text Document. And then all you want to do is call this autoexec.cfg. Now, if you don't see the, uh, the dot text at the end to change it, all you have to do is make it make it as a normal text document double click it save as in this drop down click all files and rename it to auto exec dot cfg make sure you have the dot cfg at the end that's very important and then just click save easy you have the file right click open it with notepad and then paste this in it will be in the description just copy and paste it in CL FOV scale, that's the that's the FOV scale that allows you to have higher than 110. And then this is important, bind US standard F12 exec auto exec. This will make it so every time you press F12, it will apply the commands above it. File, save, exit out. And now what you have to do is go into Steam, right click Apex, properties, general, launch options, and make sure you have this command in there plus exec auto exec dot config and that's it you're ready to go simple after you do that all you have to do when you get in game press f12 and you'll have your new fov now if you change any settings the fov will reset and you'll just have to press f12 again that's it yeah it's simple nice thank you bye bye